We are live. It's a Thursday night presentation here on 2K Sports. I'm Kevin. With tip-off fast approaching, let's first check in for a report from the sideline with David Aldridge. David. Thank you, Kevin. Now, we all have seen when the Warriors are going well, it's a thing of beauty. Coach Steve Kerr says our offense is pretty simple. We only run a few actions, but in order to thrive in it, you have to understand concepts, spacing, and cutting. We just happen to have really high IQ players. Kevin, that's always been Golden State's secret weapon. It has, and their coach reflects it, and their team plays the way he thinks. Good stuff, D.A., thanks. And now the Lakers' starting group. They'll go small with LeBron at the four and Davis at the five. Russell Westbrook out there with Patrick Beverly, and it's Walker in at the small forward. And for the Warriors, we'll see Wiggins and Green play in the forward spots. Magician is out there with Curry, and it's Howard in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. We are in for a treat in this matchup, Greg, with two conference rivals set to clash yet again. Yeah, we're going to see some added effort and intensity, and, and don't be surprised if it gets a little chippy. And it's the Warriors to start out. Curry against Westbrook. And there's the pass to Magician. Back to Wiggins. Here's Magician. That balls. Nice feed that time from Wiggins. Boy, Andrew Wiggins, the former first overall pick, showing off his passing skills there. LeBron kicks to Westbrook. Beverly feeling it out a bit. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. Pass to Wisp. And the rejection by Curry. Pass to Howard. Uses the glass to finish the layup. The concentration, the strength, the balance. Howard doing a nice job staying focused on the rim despite getting hit. And you love seeing that great mobile one drive a second time. And putting that pressure on the rim. That's what it's all about, threatening with that attack. One-on-one -on -one fast break. Here's Magician. It's blocked. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Beverly. And we got to take a second look to admire that outstanding block. And an early swat like that can really set the tone. Now the shooters will be feeling his presence. And now, just over a minute played here in the first. Curry's shot is good. And here's James. He'll bring it up for Los Angeles. Seven-point differential. Beverly, the pass to Westbrook. Outside, Walker. He feeds it to LeBron. Looking to end the run. Count that one. LeBron James refusing to be denied, just muscling through that foul to get the shot off. Hard to believe, Greg, last season, LeBron missing the playoffs for just the third time in his career. And, Kevin, it, it almost felt surreal to not have him in the playoffs. I mean, this guy's been a fixture in the postseason for almost two decades now. Just another bullet on LeBron's incredible resume. Free throw good, LeBron. And this Lakers squad has a ton of talent, but some guys are well past their prime. Passes it to Wiggins. LeBron against Green. To the inside, Curry. Props in the layup for two. 
and the shot making of Curry really unmatched. Shots like that one, the tough ones, Stefan just makes it look easy. And what do you think GA is the next step for this Lakers team? Coming off a championship not that long ago, young firepower is surely needed. These older guys can't carry a team like they used to. And a wide open look for James. And the Lakers with another miss. The Warriors have gotten four of six field goal attempts to drop in the first quarter. Oh, and they get in the way of the alley-oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. Puts it up from 12. And again, no good by the Lakers. And smothered him on that mid-range attempt. As a defender, he's going to just be a bothersome, worrisome guy, making you miserable all night. A hand in your face on every jump. Attacking in transition the most consistent way to generate easy looks. Yep, exactly. And if there's any opportunity for early offense, you've got to push it and push it every time. Traps in the tray. Logician's got six. Nice assist there. Typically attacking with the scoring move. This time, Wiggins attacks with the pass. The pass to Walker. James against Green. Whistle blows. Basket is good. So a chance here for a three-point play. And making it look easy, LeBron overwhelms the defense inside. And the Warriors making a change here. Kaminga's checked in. GA with their fourth title. The combination of Steph, Clay, and Draymond Green. The single most successful trio in the last half century in the NBA. And, and some would argue the best trio of all time. The, the most wins in the finals ever by a trio who've each made an all-NBA team. Count it. He's got six. You know, at close range, Curry has a plethora of shots. You simply can't allow him to get those looks. Here's LeBron. Los Angeles with another miss. Warriors leading by six. Curry kicks to Wiggins. Curry passes to Wiggins. Back to Curry. From past the arc, another three for Golden State. I mean, the range is just unreal. Curry can make even the toughest shots look easy. So timeout, timeout, timeout called here. The first for Los Angeles. Trying to find some answers offensively. Yeah, and you know, that's going to be the focus of this timeout. They need to come up with a spark to get the offense going. Clay Thompson, he's checked in for Andrew Wiggins. Juan Toscano Anderson's checked in for Los Angeles. Kendrick Nunn comes in for Patrick Beverly. LeBron passes to Toscano. Lakers working the ball around now. Tries it from nine. None can't get it to fall. The Warriors leading on the wing. Thompson. The three. And it's Anthony Davis with the rebound. Inside. And James throws it down. Boom. LeBron. He's still got major bounce and force on the fly. Curry is inside. He's covered by Westbrook. Howard kicks to Thompson. Back to Howard. Westbrook with the steal. All alone. And finished off by Westbrook. You know, Westbrook will not let an opportunity to embarrass his defender go wanting. Oh, my goodness. What a move. Let's take a second look at that fantastic block. An emphatic rejection that was. Boy, you've got to appreciate that kind of forceful in-your-face defense. Here's Magician, defended by none. The putback controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. Cannot leave Howard alone on the offensive glass. When you do, he's making you pay for that mistake. Back to Westbrook. Twenty six seconds left here in the first quarter. Knocked away and stolen by Howard. Pass the magician. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. 
Yeah, just nice strength there and then just off with the shot. Boy, with all the contact he drew there, that would have been a heck of a bucket. He nearly got it to go. And he makes both free throws. He's as solid as it gets from the line. I mean, give him the opportunity. He's cashing in on those. And so it's the Golden State Warriors in control with the night. And if you're just tuning in, we've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but uh, plenty of time left for a comeback. And guys, let's get your take on the scoring breakdown for the Warriors. You know, so far in this one, these guys have been knocking it down from distance. They've got to like their confidence as this game continues. They're on a nice roll. And it seems they've also put an emphasis on moving the ball, working to rotate around the defense and find those quality looks. We'll see Wiggins and Green play in the forward spots. Magician is out there with Stephen Curry, and it's Howard in at the five spot. That's the Warriors five. That was the 2K drive. Is that move deserved another look? And Kevin, little plays like that one will help them manage this lead heading into the half. How about the determination? Westbrook, and that one falls coming off of Davis's feed. Westbrook's got his second bucket of the night. You know, with AD's improved court awareness, when guys on his team get open, he'll find it. And really, whatever your take on Russell Westbrook is now, you can't deny his place in NBA history. Voted as one of the NBA's top 75 players of all time. Five on the clock. Wiggins inside the line. A shot missing. So Los Angeles will take it the other way. Bounce pass, Davis. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Great. It is impossible to argue against Westbrook belonging to that top 75 players list, isn't it? It, it really is, Kevin. I mean, his career numbers and accomplishments speak for themselves. A, a very unique player, easily one of the best during his prime. And let's head over to the sideline and catch up with David Alder. Thanks, Kevin. Of course, the Warriors offense stands out for its emphasis on ball movement. Coach Steve Kerr says if you get to touch the ball and be a part of the action, whether it's as an assist man, ball mover, shooter, dribbler, the more people who are involved in the offense, the more powerful it becomes. Kevin, strength in numbers indeed. As has always been the case for his offense, the more the better. And it's worked for him. GA, thanks. Los Angeles calls timeout. Right here's a classic NBA question. Who's been the best franchise in league history? Celtics or the Lakers? Come on, Kevin. You are putting me on the spot. But I, I'd go with the Lakers. More superstars over the years. And I think that 2000s run with Kobe and company, that put them ahead in my estimation. To the wing on the left. Brown outside. Pass to Toscano. The three. Draymond Green pulls it in. Warriors leading by nine. In the corner, it's Wiggins. Off target with his three. And here in the second quarter of action with a hair under two and a half minutes played so far. And stolen by Wiggins. Outside Curry. Puts up a three. It falls for the sixth time in seven tries this contest. That's 86%. Tell you what, it's just one of those nights where Curry finds a rhythm and just keeps on flowing. This show never gets old. Nice ball movement here by the Lakers. Pass to Toscano. Westbrook against Curry. Here's Davis, and that comes off the assist by Russell Westbrook. I think this particular play hinges on Davis's shooting ability, but you've got to set him up right, and the basket is virtually guaranteed if you do. Kicks it to Wiggins, and the pass to Green. Curry with it. Fires for three. Here's Howard, and oh, what a play. He just palms the block. To the middle. Here's LeBron. Great D that time from Green. Those are chances almost always you can rely on him to get you two points, but the D just enough to keep him out of rhythm. Westbrook against Wiggins. 
No good on the shot. A bit long that time. And it's Westbrook with the ball. He brings it up for Los Angeles. Trailing by 10. Brown the pass to James. Over Curry. And James with the basket on the assist by Brown. James has got 14. Clark, when they're evaluating draft prospects, we always hear about wingspan, arm span. How does that translate to the basketball floor? Well, it's actually reach factor, Kevin. That's a huge component of defense, particularly when you're talking about guys switching all the time. So the ability to cover ground, to challenge shots from a distance, that's why wingspan is so important. And you think about it, multiple defensive player of the year, Rudy Gobert, perhaps has the longest wingspan ever recorded at the combine. Davis down low, working on Howard. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. That's on Dwight Howard. And with the struggles AD has had to stay healthy, and you wonder, though, if the team's going to focus on having him be at his best for that postseason run and, and try to manage the wear and tear. Looking at who's out there now for the Warriors. Kuminga's come in for Wiggins, and it's Clay Thompson in for Curry. And the Warriors decide to take their first time out here. And when Davis is on the floor, Greg, he is a force. But how do you keep him healthy into the playoffs? That is the question. I mean, sustaining his output over a full season isn't easy. But Davis has had a bit of bad luck with the injury. So you have to mitigate ways to keep him available. 109 left in the second quarter. Thompson surveying the floor. Here's Magician. And it's off from three-point range. Lakers trailed by six. Floats it up for James. Throws down the alley-oop slam. Superb timing by LeBron on that alley-oop. Golden State's gotten into trouble with the three ball in the second quarter. Only hitting one of five attempts. Past the Magician. 41 seconds left here in the second. Hits the three-point bomb. Kaminga's got his first three points of the game. Dwight Howard with some slick passing on that one. And there's the call on James. That's his first foul. Yeah, really good defensive play to cut him off there and square up. Excellent example of toughness and physicality on defense. Got his nose right in the middle of things and made a play. Pass to Green. Here's Magician, defended by none. Passes it to Kaminga. And another three for Golden State. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Here's LeBron. Comes up empty from 19 feet out. Boy, he knows he should have knocked that one down, especially with the defense not giving much of an effort. And so it's the... We played through the first half. Plenty of basketball, though, left in this one. It's been a clinic out there by James. You just love the patience in that first half. Waited until he got the look he wanted. Well, you know what, guys? It was all about efficient offense, not rushing things. Taking your time, finding the best shot on every possession. Checking out the group now for Darvin Ham to start the second half. They'll go small with LeBron at the four and Davis at the five. Russell Westbrook out there with Patrick Beverly. And it's Walker in at the three. Yeah, exceptional play there to take the bump and still get it to fall. I like to call that stick to getting everything he possibly could out of that play. Warriors leading by seven. Over to the wing. Here's Magician. And Westbrook pulls it down. And Los Angeles guys uh, shooting with confidence. 50% from the field so far. And play stops. Whistle on what looks to be an illegal screen. Uh, beyond the leaning, you could see his feet more set on that screen. Easy call. Yeah, I agree. You know, sometimes that can be a tough call for the refs to make, but not that time. It was easy there. And that replay showed just how forceful that block was. Boy, and that'll give him a nice injection. Nothing like a rejection to get a team fired up. 
Curry against Westbrook. Here's Magician. Count it. Good. Ten points for Magician. One of the things you've got to admire and respect about him is his aggressiveness at the offensive end. Always in attack mode. LeBron outside. There's the triple. Basket number eight for him on 13 tries. That's 62% so far. Really nice looking stroke on James's shot from out at the arc. He can make the three-point shot look so easy, just like he does every other part of the game. Curry can't get it to go. The defense there got away with a major lapse. Green against LeBron. Westbrook. Good, and the assist goes to LeBron. Westbrook's got six. Yeah, you know, it's like the game is in slow motion for LeBron. He sees the entire floor and sees it so well, knows what's coming, and usually always makes the right pass. Westbrook against Curry. Right side, Green. Higgins outside. Green breaking loose. No good on the three. And the well is running dry for him right now. Nothing falling. And, you know, you can sense his frustration. This is going to be a test of his resolve here. And Davis wide open. He shoots. No good from outside. Oh, man, you know he'd love to have that one over. And looking at Anthony Davis, a huge part of this team. Sure is. I mean, along with every team he's been on. This is a superstar player. I mean, no question about that. He can headline a roster full of superstars. Not much on the floor that AD can't do. And there's the basket. Whistle blows and a chance for a three-point play. Going to the line for one. Boy, throwing himself on the offensive glass and being rewarded for it. That's the energy that Draymond Green brings. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. Andre Igudala is checked in for Wiggins. And Green, no good on that one. What I appreciate most about Green is his leadership. Strong vocally on and off the floor. And so Green will bring it up for Golden State. They've held a 12-point lead earlier. They blow the whistle just as he gets it off. That's two points with a chance for another one at the strike. How about battling through the impact there and then willing that basketball in? Boy, it does your heart good to see that kind of determination in a player. Really excellent focus that time. Lakers trail by nine. James outside. The pass to Beverly. Launches it. Good. And the assist goes to James. Beverly's got himself going there. His first points of the game in the deep ball. Curry kicks to Iguodala. Let's the three fly. And right on through for another basket. He's got five made on five of nine shooting. Boy, the unselfishness of Eagle Dollar is really admirable. A forward with excellent vision he has a feel for when one of his guys is open. Now Beverly. Pass to Davis. Just five to shoot. And the Lakers tack on two more. Love the unselfishness of Beverly. I mean, when he sees his teammate wide open, he quickly gets him the ball. Back to Curry. Howard with it. Green dishes to Iguodala. Knocks it loose. Stolen by Walker. As break, the Lakers. And the dunk by Westbrook. That is really where Russell Westbrook excels. In transition with that great speed of his. Now a timeout called by Golden State. Adjustments are a part of the game, and the coach sees something he doesn't like here. And you know what? We'll see what changes he makes coming out of this timeout. And some changes here for the Warriors. Kamingas come in for Howard. And it's Clay Thompson in for Curry. Warriors leading by five. Iguodala outside. Pass to Thompson. 157 left to play in the third. Six to shoot. 
for three. And they force the shot violation. clock violation. Great D. Lakers trail by five. Things really clicking for them at the offensive end. They're making good decisions, not wasting these opportunities. Here's Gabriel, guarded by Green. It's Westbrook with the drive. As one of the biggest stars in the NBA, Russell Westbrook Clark puts a lot of energy into his charity work. Yeah, he really does, and I don't know how many people really recognize that, but I know he's appreciated for it. He started the Why Not Foundation to help underserved communities, and they're doing some great work. Russ said, Why Not has always been his attitude whenever he's pursuing a tough goal, and thus he named his foundation the same way. Hey, you can't diminish Westbrook's triple doubles, but just as important to me are the intangibles, his passion, his tenacity, his competitive spirit and drive. I mean, that infects the whole team in a positive way. Passes it to the Magician. Iguodala deciding where to go with it. Dishes it to Green. He kicks it to Thompson. Buries it down low. Green's got four points in the quarter. And you know Green can get aggressive when he needs to, finding a way around tight defense inside. Fifty-one seconds left in the third quarter of the game. And again, no good by the Lakers. Hard to figure out how he doesn't knock that one down. No defender in sight. And he gets it to go as they call the foul. He's on his way to the line for one more. And that's such a funky matchup. Iggy has great handles, a strong wing, and can fight through the hit. First trip to the free throw line for him tonight. And his percentage at the line last season, right at the 75% mark. 40 seconds left in the third quarter. Now the pass to none. The Lakers moving the ball around. Down low. Takes the assist and lays it in. Picked out the pass nicely. Now how about how he sets his man up there, runs him right into the screen, and then gets the basket. Here's Magician. He's covered by Westbrook. Five to shoot. Magician passes to Thompson. Over none. Can't connect. And so it's the Golden State Warriors. Holding on to an eight-point lead, heading into the break. They're pounding the State Farm assist of the game. And, and I'm glad this was the pick because I love this pass. Such a great dish. That's what I call court vision. Yeah, and with the accuracy to go along with that vision. I mean, he put the ball in the absolute perfect spot. That's how you orchestrate it. The fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you with us. Thompson is in the front court alongside Green. Magician is out there with Stephen Curry. And it's Howard in at the five. That's the Warriors five. Curry looking it over. Off target from outside. And here's James. He'll bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Eight point game. Westbrook passes to James. And he could not get that one to go. A lot of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. They get Stephen Curry. And such a physical player inside. LeBron doesn't fear contact on the way up. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for the Warriors. I'm in love with how they're moving the basketball all game long. And also their ability to move without the ball. That style just makes it so difficult to defend. How great have they been? I mean, shooting the ball from outside the arc, they have absolutely been lights out. Pass to Curry. Fires the three. That balls. Ice feed that time from Wiggins. Wiggins has got four assists in the game. Westbrook kicks to Beverly. Pass to Walker. 
back to Beverly. He dishes it to Davis. And it's sent back by Howard. Excellent timing by Howard. He knows exactly when to jump to deny shot attempt. And it's slammed in by Howard. Oh, oh inflicting some punishment with the two-hand flush. Ah, they're going for the throat. Time out, time out. Now's the time to do it. Keep attacking that rim. Timeout called the Lakers. You can see the coach very displeased with their defensive effort on the glass. They're giving up a bunch of second chance points. They got to get that corrected. And with an update from the sidelines, let's check in with David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin, during that last break, I heard the Lakers coach talk to his team. He said they've played well in certain areas, but the lack of detail to the defensive boards has allowed their opponent too many second chance opportunities. And that, he said, is the difference in this game. They have to get busy on the glass, Kevin. Thanks, David. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. If it's working, keep working it. That's what I say. Keep the pressure on it. Over in the corner, Beverly. Knocks down the three ball. I like watching Beverly catching the defense by surprise there. Excellent at pulling up after the pass. Here's Magician, kept alive, and it's Howard finishing it off. There it is, guys, one of those effort plays that makes a big difference in the game. And GA, it is definitely making a difference so far today. Well, you know, if you're not going to take care of the defensive glass, it's going to be hard to come away with the win. Back to Walker. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. Oh, the, the officials are all over that one. Clearly a foul. I mean, didn't give them any choice but to blow the whistle. I mean, you got to play without foul. The first free throw is good. And so Walker nails both of them. Warriors leading by 10. Wiggins outside. Addition out to Howard. Golden State moving it around. That's tipped. Magician passes to Howard. Shot clock at six. Here's Magician. And it's off the back rim. No good. Lakers trail by 10. James in the post. Guided by Green. James, no good. You know, they don't score on that shot, but they're going to be happy with those kinds of possessions. Magician passes to Wiggins. Bobbed up there for Green. Davis with it. And Curry picks him up defensively. And it's Davis missing. Golden State's gone one or two from three-point range here in the fourth. Passes to Magician. A minute 50 left in the fourth quarter. And again, it's the Warriors missing. And so James will bring it up for the Lakers. Trailing by 10. Here's Green. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. And normally more comfortable dishing it. Great to see Green there being aggressive, taking charge. And the first one at the line is good. That one is no good. Lakers trailed by 11. And it's Westbrook. That time on the assist by Davis. Davis has got his third assist on the night. Westbrook has really honed his ball handling skills, so now he's able to create very well off the dribble. That was a second look at our mobile one drive. Amazing control on display. 
And you can just sense his determination, trying to do everything he can to keep this game within reach. Howard kicks to Curry. Buries it from three-point range. Timeout, timeout. Curry's got a couple of three-pointers now in the fourth for the Warriors. Uh, he's found his rhythm from deep, and, and you can see the confidence. Yeah, I'd be confident, too, as a matter of fact. I mean, if you're stacking up threes the way he is, I mean, he's doing all his work from behind the arc. And the Lakers call time here. They trail by 12. We've got 113 left in the fourth quarter. And now let's take a look at the new balance player of the game, Russell Westbrook. And, and to me, the best part of his game has been the work he's done inside. I mean, slashing, driving the lane, attacking the basket at every chance. When he's had an opening, he's taken. We've got 113 left to play here in the fourth. Here's James. And he makes the bucket, gets the whistle, and now a three-point play chance here for him. And one of those players who will not be denied. LeBron so strong inside. One oh six left in the fourth quarter. Wiggins outside. Green left side. The feed to Wiggins. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Yeah, these little nuances like the pump fake, developing aspects of Wiggins' expanding game. He hits the first one, and that will push the lead to double digits. And both free throws good for Wiggins. You know, it's interesting. Some people say Wiggins should play meaner, but to me the most important thing is that he improves his overall game every year. James. The shot, no good. The Warriors go the other way with it. Here's Curry. <laughs> And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. They get Russell Westbrook. No question, he got bumped on that shot. Yeah, the officials didn't need to talk that one over. It was obvious. And even if you're not a fan of Curry or, or a fan of his team, you can't help but marvel at some of the shots this guy sinks on a nightly basis. And it's a completely new group for Los Angeles. Stephen Curry hits them both. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. None against Curry. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. They get Stephen Curry. Clearly a foul. Yeah, he took a shot there. Earned those free throws. And he can't get the first one. And he sinks the second. Diversified scoring in this one for him. I love when everyone can get involved. A, a full team effort. Looney with it. Working on Jones. Six on the shot clock. From six feet. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. Oh, an incredibly smart player. Iguodala knows how to draw the whistle by manipulating the defense. That free throw, no good. No good at the stripe this time. Second misses also. And the all-around game Iguodala possesses makes him unique. Does whatever is asked of him on the floor. So we see the Warriors taking the game here. Some good competition, but the hometown advantage and their ability to stay focused, I think, made the difference. Yeah, and the, the first step in becoming a good team is your ability to win at home. And they really seem to revel in that opportunity. And, and this is what they came out to do.
And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. 